Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to your favorite channel PSTNs. In this video, let me show you some of the top 20 Scopus journals which is said to have higher acceptance rate. You can target these journals and get your article published. If you have any queries, then please do send us an email on PSTNs at gmail.com. If you are new to this channel, please do hit the subscribe button and stay connected with the upcoming videos so moving on to the content of the video the first journal in the list is bmc research notes bmc research notes is said to have an acceptance rate of 48 percent which is yet to get its first impact factor but according to the aims and scope it, they accept articles related to initial observation like also valid negative results etc and they provide a platform for micro publications across all disciplines this journal is indexed in various database and you can find the PubMed Central and Scopus so if you are willing to submit your research article then please do visit BMC research notes so the next in the list is parasites and vectors it has a decent impact factor of 3.031 and the acceptance rate is 47 and you can see it is an open access peer-reviewed online journal dealing with biology of parasite parasitic diseases etc and if you are willing to target this journal then please do read the aims and scope and the author's guidelines before submitting your research it is indexed in scopus and other like repeated databases so if anybody is working on parasite or its related research then you can check this journal which is having a good acceptance rate so moving on to the next journal BMC cancer it has an impact factor of 2.9 with an acceptance rate of 38 and it is an open access peer-reviewed journal uh, which welcomes the submission concerning to molecular and cellular biology, genetics, etc. So it is indexed in PubMed, PubMed Central, Scopus, and other repeated databases. So if your research is related to cancer, then you can check this journal, which is having a good acceptance rate. Now moving on to the next in the list retro virology it has a good impact factor of 3.7 with an acceptance rate of 54 percent you can see the aims and scope it is an open access online journal and it they welcome uh, research related related to fundamental mechanism of replication immune def defenses animal models clinical science related to retroviruses so if anybody is working on this area then you can check this journal it is indexed in scopus pubmed central and other reputed databases so if you are working on virology you can check this journal and get your article submitted so moving on to the next journal journal of neuroimmunopharmacology it has an impact factor of 3.8 with the acceptance rate of 41 so as the title suggests it is related to pharmacology and neurobiology so you can check the aims and scope of this journal it is abstracted or indexed in repeated data bytes in including scopus so next in the list comes toxicology and environmental health sciences it is yet to get its first impact factor but the acceptance rate is 36 which is 
signif significant enough so you can see the aims and scope of this journal they accept research articles and reviews related to fundamental and applied research of toxicity of chemicals nanoparticles drug etc so if you are working on similar aspect then you can check this journal and read the author's guidelines before communicating so moving on to the next in the list computational management science which has the acceptance rate of 47 and it is yet to get its first impact factor and as the title suggests it is com related to computer and management computational models etc and it is indexed in repeated database including scopus so moving on to the next journal information technology and tourism it has 39 percent of acceptance rate and it is yet to get its first impact factor so moving on to the aims and scope this journal accept articles related to like information technology tourism etc so you can check the journal page before communicating your research it is indexed by various database including scopus so coming on to the next journal international review on public and non-profit marketing so it has an acceptance rate of 47 this journal is yet to get its first impact factor and moving on to the aims and scope you can see the aims and scope of this journal and you can check the databases it is indexed by Scopus. So, if you are working on international review on public and non profit marketing, especially, then you can check this journal. So, moving on to the next journal in the list Euro Journal on Decision Processes. It has a significant acceptance rate of 61%. It is yet to get its first impact factor and you can see the aims and scope of this journal and it is indexed by various databases including scopus so if you are working on decision processes then you can check and target this journal so the next in the list is computational management and science it has acceptance rate of 47 and it is yet to get its first impact factor guys if you are looking for scopus index and uh, please do target these journals even though these are not having any impact factor because in future these journals are about to get their first impact factor so you can see the different aims and scope of these this journal and it is indexed by scopus and other repeated database moving on to the journal next journal in the list journal of cluster science which has an impact factor of 38% with in, sorry which has an acceptance rate of 38% with an impact factor of 2.1 which is very decent impact factor and it is having different variety of aims and scope including cluster chemistry nanomaterials etc cluster physics astrophysics cluster biology life sciences and all so if you are looking for any journal related if you are working on this related aspect and looking for the journal then you can easily target journal of cluster science and it has it has been indexed by scopus and other reputed 
databases. So next comes in the list is Polymer Bulletin. It has an impact factor of 1.8 with uh, acceptance rate of 42%. You can see the aims and scope of this journal which has uh, a wide range of aims and scope related to polymer science including chemistry, physical chemistry, physics, material science, etc. It is indexed in Scopus and if you are working on the area of polymer then you can easily target this journal. Moving on to the next journal in the list BMC Chemistry. BMC Chemistry is having acceptance rate of 41% with 2.0 impact factor and you can see the aims and scope they are accepting articles related to analytical chemistry organic chemistry environmental and energy chemistry agriculture and food chemistry etc and you can see it is indexed by pubmed central scopus and other reputed databases so next in the list is cellulose it has a good impact factor of 3.9 with the acceptance rate of 46 which is really good with the impact factor and as the name indicates it accept articles related to cellulose like it manuscripts are welcome that are based on fundamental applied aspects of physics chemistry biochemistry and material science of polymers so they are accepting reviews original research communication technical notes so if you have any research related to these aims and scope then you can check the journal and try to get published it is indexed in scopus as well so moving on to the next journal plasmonics it has an impact factor of 2.9 with acceptance rate of 42 you can see the aims and scope which is related to advances in theory physics application of surface plasmons in metals and rapidly emerging areas of nanotechnology, biophotonics, sensing, biochemistry, medicine, etc. So you can see the aims and scope, and you can see the indexing pattern of this journal. It is indexed by Scopus, Google Scholar, etc. So if you are working on these related research, then you can target. So moving on to the next journal, Macromolecular Research. It has an impact factor of 1.7 with the acceptance rate of 35. Macromolecular Research publishes original research aspects related to polymer science, engineering and technology. And papers include articles, communication, notes, reviews, featured article on the same basis. So you can find the aims and scope of this journal and it is indexed by Scopus. So if you are working on molecular research, macromolecular research, then you can target this journal if your research is related to polymer science. So next in the list is Journal of Thermal Analysis and Calorimetry. Calorimetry here you can see the impact factor of 2.4 with acceptance rate of 46. So they accept articles related to thermal analysis, calorimetry, experimental thermodynamics, etc. They accept original research papers, short communication reviews, modern instruments, events, and book reviews. So you can find the indexing pattern of this journal it is indexed by Scopus, Sci, Google Scholar, and other repeated databases. So the next journal in the list is Journal of Radioanalytical and Nuclear Chemistry. 
which is having an impact factor of 1.1 a decent impact factor to start with with the acceptance rate of 55 which is really really good and they publish original papers letters review papers and short communication on a nuclear chemistry and it is indexed in various databases including scopus uh, google scholar etc so last but not the least international journal of plastics technology it has an impact factor of 50 percent sorry it has an impact factor, sorry sorry once again it has an acceptance rate of 50 with impact factor of zero which is yet to get its impact factor so it welcomes uh, research related to polymer plastic engineering and technology so if you are working on plastic or polymer related research then you can check the journal and target your upcoming research article it is indexed by various repeated data bases and also scopus so with this let me conclude my video and remind you to please do subscribe to my channel PhDNs and stay connected with the upcoming related videos on research and publishing tips. Guys this video is provided based on the information mentioned at Springer Nature. Uh, journal finding tool if you can find your related research in these uh, journal finding tools then please do read the aims and scope authors guidelines before you could target your journal if you are if you are thinking of uh, looking if you are thinking of targeting uh, journals with impact factor with no publication fees then you can check our videos which we have already published with spring journal journal with no publication charges so with this i would like to conclude wish you all the best in your research endeavors and if you have any queries please do contact us at phdns at gmail.com goodbye